Did you know that the average person uses over 100 gallons of water per day, and taps play a crucial role in that? Let's dive into how these everyday essentials are made. Imagine producing something that needs to withstand constant water pressure, resist corrosion, and still look good in your kitchen or bathroom. It's a balancing act. Add to that the need for eco-friendly materials and the challenge of keeping costs down, and you've got a real puzzle to solve. These manufacturers are constantly innovating to keep up with trends and technology while ensuring safety and functionality. It's no small feat. One, selecting the materials. Did you know that the first step in making a water tap starts with choosing the right materials? Most taps are made from brass or stainless steel because these metals are super strong and don't rust easily. This means your tap can handle lots of water pressure without breaking down. It's kind of amazing to think that the same metal used in huge construction projects is also used to make the tap in your kitchen. When manufacturers choose materials like brass or stainless steel for making taps, they're not just picking any metal, they're selecting materials that have some pretty special qualities. For example, brass is an alloy made from copper and zinc, and it has natural antimicrobial properties. This means that germs and bacteria have a hard time surviving on its surface, which is a big deal for something that handles water every day. Stainless steel, on the other hand, is incredibly durable and resistant to corrosion, which is why it's often used in harsh environments, like in ships or skyscrapers. What's even cooler is that these materials are often recycled, so the tap in your kitchen might have once been part of something totally different, like an old car or even a musical instrument. This recycling not only makes the tap more eco-friendly, but also ensures that high-quality materials are being reused in something as essential as your water tap. 2. Melting and molding Next, the metal is melted down until it's a liquid, just like lava. This molten metal is then poured into special molds that shape it into the basic form of a tap. Imagine pouring hot liquid into a mold and then letting it cool, it hardens, into the shape of the tap. This is like creating a sculpture out of metal, and every mold is carefully designed to make sure the tap will work perfectly. When the metal is melted down to create water taps, the temperature has to reach incredible heights, over 1700 degrees Fahrenheit, around 930 degrees Celsius, for brass. At this temperature, the metal becomes a glowing, molten liquid, almost like lava. But here's the really fascinating part. The molds used to shape the taps aren't just simple containers. They're often made from high-tech materials like sand or ceramic that can withstand these extreme temperatures. These molds are intricately designed to create not only the outer shape of the tap, but also the internal channels where water will flow once the tap is in use. It's a bit like pouring cake batter into a mold, but instead of a cake, you get a perfectly shaped tap that will last for decades. And because the molds can be reused, this process is efficient and allows for consistent production of thousands of taps, each one precisely the same as the last. 3. Cutting and shaping. Once the metal cools down and solidifies, the rough tap shape needs to be refined. This is where precision machines come in. These machines cut and shape the tap to exact measurements, making sure every piece fits together just right. The cool part? These machines are so precise that they can cut the metal down to the tiniest detail, ensuring that every tap looks and works exactly as it should. It's like watching a craftsman carve something out of stone, but way faster and with laser-like accuracy. When it comes to cutting and shaping the tap, precision is everything. The metal parts are placed in machines that use cutting tools to carve out the exact dimensions needed for the tap. What's truly fascinating is how these machines operate. They use a process called CNC machining, which stands for Computer Numerical Control. This means that every movement of the cutting tool is controlled by a computer, allowing for incredible precision down to fractions of a millimeter. This level of accuracy ensures that all the parts fit together perfectly, which is crucial for preventing leaks and ensuring smooth operation. Another cool fact, some of the cutting tools are coated with diamond particles. Yes, actual diamonds. This is because diamond is one of the hardest materials known, and it allows the tools to slice through metal with ease, creating smooth edges and intricate designs. So when you see the sleek lines and perfect curves of your tap, you're looking at the result of some of the most advanced manufacturing technology out there. 4. Quality Control Checks Now, before the taps are put together, each piece goes through strict quality control checks. This is where the factory makes sure everything is up to standard. They check for leaks, 
test the tap's functionality, and even inspect the finish to make sure it's perfect. It's like the tap goes through a series of challenges to prove it's worthy of making it into your home. Only the best pieces make the cut, so when you turn on your tap, you know it's going to work perfectly. Quality control in tap manufacturing isn't just a quick glance to see if things look good, it's a rigorous process that involves both high-tech gadgets and old-fashioned human scrutiny. One of the coolest parts of quality control is the leak test. Each tap is pressurized with water or air far beyond what it would normally experience in your home to ensure it won't leak even under extreme conditions. This process is so sensitive that it can detect leaks as small as a pinhole, which could lead to problems down the line. Number 5. Assembling the tap Once all the parts pass their tests, it's time to put the tap together. Skilled workers carefully assemble each component, making sure everything fits together seamlessly. This part of the process combines both machine precision and human skill. It's like putting together a complex puzzle, and the result is a fully functional tap that's ready to use. You can almost feel the excitement as the tap finally comes to life. The assembly of a water tap is like putting together a complex puzzle, where every piece has to fit just right for the tap to work perfectly. What's fascinating is how this process combines both cutting-edge automation and skilled craftsmanship. Some parts of the assembly are done by precise robotic arms that can place tiny components with incredible accuracy, like threading a needle. These robots ensure that each tap is assembled exactly the same way, down to the smallest screw, making the process incredibly efficient. But here's where the human touch really shines. Despite the advanced technology, certain parts of the assembly still require the skill and experience of a human worker. For example, the final adjustments and fine-tuning are often done by hand. Workers make sure that all the moving parts, like handles and valves, operate smoothly and with the right amount of resistance. This human involvement is crucial because it's not just about putting the tap together, it's about making sure it feels right when you use it. And did you know that some high-end taps are even tested by hand after assembly? Workers will manually turn the handles, check the water flow, and listen for any unusual sounds. It's a perfect blend of automation and craftsmanship, ensuring that every tap not only functions flawlessly, but also feels just right when you turn it on for the first time. 6. Polishing and Finishing Before the tap is ready to leave the factory, it needs to look its best. The final step is polishing and finishing. The tap is polished to give it that shiny, smooth surface that feels great to the touch. This also helps protect the tap from corrosion and makes it easier to clean. It's like giving the tap a final makeover before it heads out into the world. Polishing and finishing might sound like simple steps, but they're actually where the tap gets its final touch of luxury. After all the assembly is done, the tap still needs to look as good as it functions. This is where the magic of polishing comes in. High-speed buffing wheels and specialized polishing compounds are used to give the tap its shiny, mirror-like surface. What's really cool is that the finish isn't just for looks. Polishing also smooths out any microscopic imperfections in the metal, making the tap more resistant to corrosion and easier to clean. But here's a surprising fact. Some high-end taps go through multiple stages of polishing, often by hand, to achieve that perfect gleam. In some cases, artisans even use ultra-fine polishing cloths and pastes to create a flawless finish. After polishing, the tap might be coated with a special finish like chrome, nickel, or even gold. These coatings don't just add to the tap's appearance, they also provide an extra layer of protection against wear and tear. 7. Packaging and Shipping Finally, the completed taps are carefully packaged and shipped out to stores and homes around the world. The packaging ensures that each tap arrives in perfect condition, ready to be installed in your bathroom or kitchen. It's amazing to think that the tap you use every day has gone through such a detailed and fascinating process to get to you. Packaging and shipping might seem like the final simple step, but it's actually a critical part of ensuring that the tap arrives at your home in perfect condition. What's fascinating is the amount of care and engineering that goes into designing the packaging. Each tap is often individually wrapped in protective materials like foam or bubble wrap to prevent scratches and dents during transit. But did you know that some manufacturers go even further by vacuum sealing their products? This technique not only keeps the tap secure, but also protects it from moisture and dust which can be especially important for taps with delicate finishes like brushed nickel or gold plating. What's really interesting is the thought put into the boxes themselves. 
The boxes are often designed to be sturdy enough to handle the rough conditions of shipping, yet easy to open without damaging the tap inside. Some high-end brands even include a final quality check at the packaging stage, where workers give the tap one last inspection before it's packed up. And here's a cool fact. Some companies have started using eco-friendly packaging materials, like recycled cardboard and biodegradable fillers, to reduce their environmental impact. Even the printing on the boxes is carefully considered, using water-based inks that are less harmful to the environment. It's amazing to think about how much innovation and effort goes into something we use so often without a second thought. At We All Makers, we love diving into the behind-the-scenes processes that create the products we rely on daily. Whether it's water taps, kitchen utensils, or anything in between, there's always a story of craftsmanship and ingenuity waiting to be told. Thank you for joining us on this journey, and we hope you gained a new appreciation for the engineering marvels in your home.